Where's all my LARP stuff at? I'm Max Sterling. Welcome to LARP. Where'd I put my stuff two years ago when LARPing stopped? And now I have an event happening this weekend and I never bothered to put anything together, do any work on my kit until the last possible minute mix. Let's try to find my stuff. Oh man, I hope mice didn't need it. Oh. One. These are what's called a WIP, or a work in progress. That should be it. <laughs> Let's see what we got. All right, leather armor. Not too rusty, not too stained. Good. Swords. Oh my, these are much heavier than I remember. Oh my. Oh, okay. Swords, check. Box. Uh huh. Okay. Daggers. I made these on my channel. What else? Gloves. Come on now. Gloves. Bracers. Greaves. Sword hanger with lantern. Got my lock picks. Potions. Hope they're not expired. Um, well, more bracers. Plate. Satchel with items. More potions. Coins, yeah. I know game runners, game runners love it when you keep their coins. Coins. Um, nice. This is, oh, that's what's up. Gotta smell good. Baby hatchet. Elf costume. Various things. Potions. Skulls. All right, yeah, I think it's all here. <sighs> now the main question is, does any of this stuff still fit? Gloves check. Bracers check. Wait, 
Where's my cloak? Where's my shirt? Where's my pants? Where's... Okay, so this is great. This is like half of my costume. Where's... Where's my shirt? Oh. <laughs> Where's my cloak? Boots. Yes. Cloak. Shirt. Um, undergarments and skull cap. All right. Now we're in business. I'm making this video partially because I think that I'm probably not the only one out here struggling to find their LARP stuff. If you put your stuff up and you haven't moved houses in the last two years and everything is just where exactly it should be, congratulations to you. For all of you out there who are like me and had to dig through 14 boxes to find different individual pieces of your LARP stuff, even though you think you keep it organized in a single solitary box, um, yeah. I hope that you were able to find everything. Finally, I was able to get everything together. Now, like I said, does it fit? Let's find out. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Oh, yeah. Like a glove. <laughs> well, at least I grew in the right places. Okay. Pants. Check. Oh, where's my shirt? Shh, it's not my shirt. Oh my, where's my shirt? Ah, oh, where's my shirt? This is not my shirt. Whatever. Put this on. <laughs> this even. Alright, where's my hat? Oh. Here's my shirt. Here's my hood. 
Alright, shirt. You're not supposed to go on. Alright, whatever, shirt. Sure, we'll skip you. <laughs> you probably fit. Um. That's great. I forgot I broke my cloak last game last season. So I'm gonna need to fix that. Well, if you were smart and sort of baseball cap in your cloak, guess what? Oh, look at that. Cloak hood stays right up, just like a baseball hat. Nice. the armor is the uh, the true testament of how much we've grown <laughs> over the last two years so You're gonna have to give me a second. This is gonna require a little bit of uh, recalibration on the uh, old armor here. Also, I think my cloak is stuck. <laughs> of time and adjustments I have my kit on sorry you can't really see the bottom half but it's there um, so I just have to decide if I want to go with my older style or my newer ones that I have I think these probably look a lot better um, I'm gonna go with my easy little speedy ones for right now. So these just, I put elastic on. I mean, we're not fighting, you know, HEMA here. So just whatever looks the part. That's the good thing about fantasy games, historical accuracy, whatever. They just have to fit and look the part. On swords. Where's my hood? Come on. Let's move my hood. Okay. Good. stuff this is sad sword uno sword two <laughs> I forgot my hanger all right well we'll pretend <laughs> so sword two 
daggers. Go in pockets. For now. Sneaky, sneaky. Gloves. I'm Max Sterling, welcome to LARP Mix. Okay, great. <clears throat> I think I have everything, I think everything fits. I need to do a little bit more adjusting, but oh my, I'm glad I decided to do this before I'm in the parking lot at the game. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this little video. Um, I just, I started looking for stuff, I couldn't find anything, and I knew that there had to be other people out there experiencing the same troubles. I know that this video doesn't really have much useful content, but hopefully maybe a laugh for you. Um, <clears throat> you know, when you have a long break between games, you really should store your stuff someplace where you're going to remember where it's at. You should store it properly. At the end of the last game that I attended before COVID, um, which I don't really talk about on my channel because it's a downer and we all know about it and there's no point in really talking about it, but I just took my stuff off like I always do. Um, I did wash my shirt, my cloak and stuff. That's why it was all separate from my other items. But then I just sort of threw it all back in the box, you know, and I planned to go to LARP the next month and the next month just never happened. So. Um, there it sat and everything got sort of separated and lost and you know it took me probably about two hours to find all of my stuff. My swords were in one area, my armor was separate, uh, my soft stuff was all in a bag in a closet that was just sort of, well you saw it was just a black trash bag. I didn't even know it was in there. I really had to like rip my place apart to find it. And then just <clears throat> there's still stuff like I don't have boots so I'm in the process of trying to you know, turn this pair of brown boots black before the event, which is literally just in like three days. This is how long I waited. I had years, years of prep time. And here I am three days before an event calling off work so I can find this stuff, make sure it fits, and then try to fix it all up. Um, that unboxing video I did, I still gotta try to mount those daggers if I can before the event. Just so much stuff to do. And I know that I'm probably not the only one um, out there and whether you LARP or cosplay or whatever it is that you do, <laughs> waiting till the last minute just sort of always be seems to be the thing or there's something that always comes up last minute but just um, you know in the future um, this video is as much for me as it is for all of you just we got to be organized. Um, <laughs> try to keep the stuff in one place at least um, if we can remember to do so. I got off lucky most of my stuff all still fits. I can still actually worm into that armor. Um, I ended up not having to take it out. I just forgot that I have to sort of like turn my head and slide it down over me. Um, so I was able to get into it, but it is quite a bit tighter than it was previously. So um, I may let it out just a little bit. Um, <clears throat> but like I said, I hope the video was fun and exciting. Comment below. If you uh, are organized and find that this video is complete folly, you can laugh at me in the comments. If you're just like me, that's great. Let me know how your things went back to your first game. I know some people have already been playing, but for me, 
Um, we lost a lot of venues. Um, a lot of places went out of business. Places are super busy because people are trying to make up for that lost time. So my main game that I play, this is the first event I've been back to. Um, so I'm really excited to get into it. And if you haven't been to your first game back yet, um, I hope it's soon. If you have already been back, I hope it went great for you. And, um, you know, I look forward to making some more content here. We got tons of stuff coming out um, this summer. I'm going to make a sh <laughs> sensors. <laughs> I'm going to make a ton of videos for the channel here. Um, so be sure, to, <laughs> be sure to stay tuned. And, uh, you know, there's a super thanks button now below. You can clip my videos if you want to share something somewhere to laugh at me. Feel free to make GIFs or memes or whatever you want to do. Um, and uh, just you know, be sure to like, comment, and just let everybody that you know know about my channel. That's really what helps me to grow. And I hope that um, you know my channel is interesting and fun enough that most of you enjoy it. Anyways, enough talking. Until next time, adventure on.